Hey everyone, in this tutorial we're going to go over creating a team tournament. So to start off with, from the competitions tab, tap the green plus button, create new tournament, give our tournament a name, and choose the team format that we want to play. For this example, we'll choose scramble. Tap create, and now we've created our tournament. The first thing you're going to want to do is to add the players to your tournament. So tap the players chip, the green plus button, and create user. And now that we've created four users, tap done. We're given the option to send those players an invite link to our tournament and we can see that the four users have been added. Next thing we'll do is go to the leaderboard tab and now we can add our tournament rounds. If your tournament spans multiple days you can add a different tournament round for each day in the tournament. So we'll tap the green plus button, add tournament round, choose our course, Choose the tees that we're going to be playing from, tap create, and we're done creating our first round. Next thing we're going to want to do is to create the teams in our tournament, so tap the green plus button, add team, choose the players we want on the first team, user 1 and user 2, tap done. We can change the team name if we want, but we'll leave it as team 1 for now. Tap create and we can see our team has been added to the leaderboard. We'll do the same thing for the second team, so tap the green plus button. And we can see we have both teams added to the leaderboard. The next thing we're going to want to do is to set up the tee times. So go to the groups tab, tap the green plus button, We'll have team one going off first. And you can have four players per team. I'm just doing two to keep it simple. We'll create a second tee time for the second team. And now we're all set up and ready to go. On the day of your tournament, the players can tap the green play button beside their name to start keeping track of their score. And they can tap the plus button to start entering their whole scores. If you tap back, we can see that this team is now showing up on the leaderboard. We can do the same for team two. And that's it. You're all set up and ready to go for your first team event.